my friends welcome on today's video this is a fall one pot meal and our host today is miss leona at ebony ivory and thyme and miss stephanie from at creative miss me and they asked us to prepare a fall one pot meal and on today's video i'm going to prepare my italian creamy sausage recipe in this recipe, you will need some Italian sausages. And if you cannot find the Italian sausages without the casing, all you have to do is split it down the middle and the casing will automatically come off. So make sure you take the casing off. So I use approximately three to four sausages and you have to fry these first. And I definitely put this recipe inside my description box. to melt about two teaspoons of butter you don't need much just enough to saute some onions so the first step we're gonna have to do with this is to saute your onions add your sausages to fry and just make sure that you're breaking up your sausages so it will not be lumpy in your pan. The sausages is looking good and smelling real good. I love Italian sausages. And you see the steam coming from this. So, guys, you're going to love this dish if you try it. And as you frying your sausages, just make sure you're stirring it so that it will not stick to your pan. And immediately after, just drain the oil off it so you don't want the oil left in the pan. added some sun dried tomatoes and make sure you cut them up because some sun dried tomatoes is larger than others and there's some I saw in Walmart they were more smaller but if you have some that are kind of big but just make sure that you're cutting it up and just saute that just a little bit you don't have to really cook that too long because it's already sun dried it's already cooked but we're just putting this in here for flavor Now you can add your water in and you should add three to four cups and just depends on how much noodles that you're going to put in this. This is a one part meal, but if you choose to do your noodles separate, it's up to you. But we're going to put everything together in one pot. Next, I'm going to add my heavy cream milk and you need heavy cream milk for this. And if you cannot find heavy cream milk, I will leave the recipe on how to do your own heavy cream milk. And make sure you're stirring all this together. Now I am using penne noodles for this. So when you use this penne noodles, use two cups of noodles. Now, as we estimate in this, you can add more water because make sure the water is covered because with these noodles you may need to cook this about 20 minutes making sure the noodles is cooked thoroughly and if it's not you can always still add extra water and if you love garlic bread 
cook some garlic braised sticks in an air fryer. It only takes approximately five minutes. Here I used Parmesan cheese, but this is the wrong one. I thought this was the cheese Parmesan cheese and not the, the powder, but I used it anyway. But get Parmesan cheese. For some reason, the store was out of mozzarella cheese and Parmesan cheese, so I picked up this. But I didn't care for it too much because it kind of clunk a little bit. So I kind of pulled that cheese out, to be honest with you. But I used yellow cheese, my mild cheese. That's why it looked like this, because I couldn't run back to the store. And the final step is to add your spinach. It doesn't take long to cook spinach. So you put the spinach on the end and allow the spinach to cook. And that's it. And just let it sit for about 10 minutes to thicken. Take it off the eye after it's cooked. And guys... That is it. I love this Italian dish. I got this from my daughter-in-law. I'm telling you, this is so delicious. It reminds me of a dish at Olive Garden. So if you love Italian food, Olive Garden, you will love this dish. It doesn't take long at all. And if you want to add broccoli instead, if you want to add turkey meat instead you can if you don't eat pork you can play with this this is your meal so guys this is so good and this is my garlic bread sticks and i'm telling you i have loved this dish i'll cook this many 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 days and i'll keep cooking it but i know I can't keep cooking it because I'll get tired of it. But I hope that you enjoyed this video. And please go back and watch the playlist. Thank our host, Miss Stephanie from Created Miss Me and Miss Leona for Everly Ivory and Thine. Please go back and watch their channel. Y'all have a blessed and prosperous day. God bless you from Penny. Bye-bye.